Hey guys, this is Twisted Impulse of Seven Sins. Just making a quick tutorial on how to use Easy Freeboot for your 13146 rebooter. Um, first of all, you're going to need the original NAND or one of your already made NANDs. You can get your current NAND off your Xbox using Flash 360. Um, you also need your CPU key. I'm just going to copy mine now. Um, and that's about it. So I'm going to go and run Easy Freeboot now. Now I'm going to go for 13146 and Zell Reloaded. I'm leaving mine stock because I have normal wiring. Um, AUD clamp for those who have that method of soldering. Um, and people who don't have a DVD drive go for the tray open. Um, that's about it. Um, click freeboot image when you're ready to go. Um, select your original NAND, and it'll ask you which. Well, it'll ask you if the image you selected is correct. Mine's Falcon with a CB of five seven seventy, so yes. Um, just paste your CPU key here if you want to use the network you can run Zalus on your JTAG and put your IP in and Easy Freeboot will get your CPU key for you. Um just click OK and it'll run I build. Press enter. Uh save mine to the desktop. So got this. I'm gonna copy it and I'm gonna put it on my flash drive. and give that a minute and that's all there is to it um, I'll include Flash 360 I'll upload it to Mega Upload for you um, just need that in a folder I have mine on here and uh, Flash 360 so I'm going to run that on my Xbox now. Um, so yeah, that's all there is for the computer part. Uh, I'll take a video of me update my JTAG now and just do the same. Okay, so first I'd like to apologise for the bad video quality. I've had to use my phone for this, so yeah, it's kind of bad. So go ahead and plug in your USB pen drive into your JTAG. Uh, it's kind of hard to do with one hand, so it took me a little bit. Uh, just turning on. Yeah, the audio quality was really bad through my phone, so I'm recording it on the computer now. Turn on. Uh, sign in and go to XEX menu as you normally would. Make sure that you have Flash 360 um, on your USB pen drive somewhere um, and up the flash stop bin on your root, on the root of your pen drive. Which means not in a folder for those that don't know. So just finding mine now. USB, Flash 360 and press A to write to the NAND press B and then if it comes up with this again press start and start again and then press A and it will write to the NAND don't know why it was giving me errors but it's fine The other alternative you have is use Zealous itself. I think I said that earlier. Um, press back a couple of times and as you can see here it will shut the JTAG down in 5 seconds. Just turn mine back on now. And 
Here we go. I'll probably fast forward through the annoying startup stuff when I come to edit this video. So yeah, just choosing all the uh, settings with the 13146 dashboard update um, they added an auto off feature that if your Xbox is left for an hour unattended it will automatically shut down so for those that don't want this and want the normal six hour one or just not on at all um, go to the options and turn that off when you're ready because uh, that's happened to me and it's annoying when it just turns off when you've left it to do something or you're talking to someone <laughs> for those that don't know you can press Y on the second thing and it'll give you the option to exit the second startup feature that pissed me off so yeah, just showing the dashboard version and system info. Two point oh point one three one four six point zero. And just to show that it's not killed my Xbox in any way. XCX menu. Yes, all there is to say is thanks for watching and hope this was helpful.